Here's a tutorial on how to do the extended thumb round. The extended thumb round looks like this. I recommend using a pen mod for this trick. The prerequisites are a thumb round with an index push or a wrist flick, and either an index around or a neosonic reverse. The extended thumb round starts off with a thumb around index push, spins on top of the hand, and rotates into the 1 2 slot. If this is too confusing, do this next step with me. Take your pen and do this. Now take your pen and do this. Once you understand this step, do it all in one motion. This is essentially the motion of the extended thumb round. Here are other ways to think of the extended thumb round. You can think of it as a thumb round with a fingerless index around. You can also think of it as a thumb spin, which you catch it into the 1 2 slot. You can also think of it as a thumb around with a neosonic rev. Notice how the extended thumb around, or the fake double, always ends on the blue side, because we always make two full revolutions. I recommend starting your extended thumb arounds close to the cap so you have a consistent spot to start your extended thumb rounds. If your pen spins too much on the top, you're throwing it too much to the side. Try to throw it more vertically. If your pen keeps hitting your thumb, try to pinch your fingers closer together so that it will make it all the way around. If you can catch it in the 1 2 slot, try to catch it in all the other slots. And that's how you do an extended thumb around. Here are some ways to use the extended thumb around. Extended thumb around to a bust. Extended thumb around to an inverse bust. Extended thumb around to a middle around. High Tua. Adding an extended thumb round after a bust so you can do multiple TAs.